Roberto, a, a fabulous result. Um, some of your players celebrated at the end like you won the FA Cup or something. That's, that's what it means, 21 years since those supporters saw their club win here. Well, you can imagine. Uh, it, it was something that we had to do. Is um, You're looking, I don't know how many years, uh, 12, 13, that we couldn't go. In, in the so-called top four away from home and being able to win games and I thought that was a big battle today. We had to break that mentality. I thought we were, uh, we were outstanding in the manner that we were playing Man United eye to eye. I thought we created chances, they created chances, a really open game, good game of football and then to be able to have the nerve and the composure and the quality to, to keep a clean sheet and win the game I think is just what we deserve. I thought many of the best performances in the games on both sides actually were defensive performances, but no one better than Phil Jagielka, who I thought was tremendous tonight. He was, he was. I think it would be a big crime just to highlight one player today. I thought even the subs, when they came on, they had to have the right mentality and the right intensity to pick up the pace. I thought the, the team was terrific. I think we grew into the game. I think we became arrogant in the second half. We kept the ball for long spells. and. And you were feeling, when we had a couple of good opportunities, you, you're feeling, well, maybe we're not going to, uh, we're going to accept there's not going to be um, the time to win and, and then you get that real uh, deserved goal. I think overall we need to carry on working. I think we need to get better in many aspects and we know it as a team, but it doesn't get any better than being able to come to Old Trafford and, and get a three well-deserved points. And you've, you've unearthed a standing left-back who can't stop scoring. <laughs> well, Brian has is, is been a, a, great, a great example in terms of professionalism and been waiting for his, for his opportunity. And when you get the opportunity, if you're not ready, this is going to be very difficult. And I think Brian has come on in the last two games and he showed that he's ready to help the team. Uh, we want to get Leighton uh, Baines back as quick as we can because what we want is real good competition. But it's pleasing to see a, a, a player like, uh, like Brian that is getting the rewards of all his hard work behind the scenes and a, a real, real example for all the youngsters at our football club. There were, there were many chances at, at both ends. Obviously, they hit the woodwork twice. Kevin Morales hit the post. Jared De La Feo had that great opportunity. Uh, I just couldn't see it finishing nil-nil. Did you feel the same? Yes, yes. I think it's fair to say that we would, we we did expect Man United to have their chances, but I thought we were very confident with Tim. Uh, Tim Howard has been in a terrific form, and as you mentioned, Phil Jagielka and Sylvain Distan as a as a partnership. Um, it takes uh, ahead uh, a huge effort for the opposition to score a goal, and then in the other side, as an away team. Uh, is when you feel that you're going to get one or two opportunities maximum. I think the way we played, the way we were ambitious with our attacking play, we created many, many chances and we took one. As you mentioned, we had probably easier ones, but it's, it's just overall, I think it's fair to say that if you're looking at the overall performance, uh, we deserve the three points and, and that's an incredible, an incredible statement from, from, from a, a, a team like Manchester United, the, the champions that they were playing at home.